Hello everyone, and welcome to the Brookline High School Drama Society's ninth grade play, Oz. Please give me a The show runs just under an hour with no intermission. Thank you so much for joining us today. Sit back and enjoy the show. Mortality. Jill, 
Ah, uh, yes. Dear Sister Jill, a shame. Not your fault, you know. It was my fault! Ah, uh, you see, that's the kind of thinking we are trying to avoid. I was driving the car! Well, accidents happen. But your mind has slipped. Just a bit. Cracked, if you will. And slipped a notch or two into the world I like to call messed up. And so, in that slippage, out pops you an umbrella for the rain. Are we going somewhere? We're always going somewhere. I'd pull back something if I were you. Why? Because in five seconds, a tornado is going to hit this house. Five, four, three, what two, is happening? one. I'm 
being honest with you. <laughs> Wait a minute. Am I in? You're not in Kansas anymore. Toto? Fuck fuck! What? This is a stuffed dog! Do you think it's gonna say anything on its own? <laughs> Fine! Shut it up. <laughs> Man, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Oh. Wait, wait! Where are you going? Hello? Can someone please tell me what's going on here? Toto, say something! Bark, bark! I'm not doing this, okay? I'm not! Doing what? The whole tornado little dog wicked witch thing! I'm not Dorothy! I never said you were Dorothy. Dorothy was sweet and nice and very pretty. Considering her parents did well in school, the differences between you are stout. I'm not playing this part. Take the dog. He's gonna bite me. Take the stupid dog and take me home. I'm afraid I can't do that. Just turn around this tornado and we'll go back home. We'll just go backwards. There's only one way you can go in life. Forwards. Now, if you're through with this little tantrum, you have a journey to go on. I'm not doing it. That isn't a choice you can make. You're already on the journey. There's no avoiding that. Now, you're about to land in five, what? four, Where are we going? Three, I don't two, know. What is this? One. to be a wizard. Are you an idiot? Only a wizard would insult someone upon first meeting them. Sorry, um, there has been a huge mistake. I don't belong in this movie. Friends! In payment for your great service to the Munchkin people, I present to you these ruby slippers. Which you may wear on your journey at... Jeez, you... They're not big! <laughs> hey guys, look at this wizard's feet. They're huge! Ooh. Look! I want to go home. That's all I'm trying to do here. I don't want you to go through the whole song and dance. Just point me away from the wizard and I'll be on my way. But you are the wizard! No, I mean the Wizard of Oz. Oh, him. Just point me in the direction of the Yellow Road. Oh, that? We've had some problems with that. With the Yellow Road? Can you see? Down for a second, this will take some <laughs> <laughs> What happened to the Yellow Brick Road? Well, it turns out the Lollipop Guild were overinflating their real estate prices. <laughs> <laughs> so we've had something we like to refer to as an explosive financial meltdown. <laughs> So we don't really have the Yellow Brick Road anymore. Where is it? We sold it to foreign investors. <laughs> but we have some wonderful pictures of it. I have a few in my wallet. Um, how am I supposed to find the wizard? That's a good question. I have an idea. While you wait, you might want to buy some real estate here in Munchkinville. There are some great deals to be had. I happen to be the real estate agent as well as me. I'm not buying real estate. I'm just a kid. Oh, Jack, kids can buy real estate. It happens all of the time. <laughs> well, I don't have a job or anything. It doesn't matter. We have this thing called a bank. And a bank just hands out free money to everyone! It's a party! I find that the best thing to do in a crisis is to stay right where you are, keep doing exactly what you've been doing. Routine, routine, routine. 
I fear change. Hope that helps! <laughs> that doesn't help at all. Well, if you don't want to stay here forever, I guess you can go that way. But, be afraid. Be very, very afraid. The woods are especially dark at night, and without a path to guide you, you'll most certainly be attacked by lions, tigers, and bears be eaten! Lollipop? Thanks. Good luck. I hope your death is quick and painless. Oh, wait, wait! Can I just go? Since you're technically responsible for the death of the wicked witch and the I king. didn't do that! Right, but since that's what we're gonna tell the people, you're gonna be blamed for it. You'll have to look out for her sister, the Wicked Witch of the West. She's a real who? Don't worry, with your amazing magical powers, you'll be able to defeat her in a spectacular, amazing, epic battle! I don't have any magical powers! Oh, that's not... Good for you then. Uh, we're actually gonna go now and not talk to you anymore. Uh, go up with the dying. Bye, goodbye. Bye, Bye. 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 <laughs> Well, that was helpful. Come on, Toto. What? Now I'm talking to you. I must really be going crazy. Very gorgeous today. Oh, it's such a joy! I think it. You're Glinda, the Good Witch of the North. I'm Glinda, Good Witch of the North. That's kind of what I just said. You must be Dorothy. I'm Beth, actually. <laughs> no matter. Would you like to join me for tea? I've enchanted this area to provide us with all the best possible teas. You see, I'm a witch. I got that from your name. Actually, I'm just trying to find the wizard so I can get out of here. He is so wonderful. I know that, but I'm not actually Dorothy, and the Yelbrook Road was sold. Come sit and have tea with me. I'm not really interested. Sit and have tea now! Okay. <laughs> so, I'm here to kill the Wicked Witch of the East. Good for you. She was a real girl. I didn't, actually. Girls have to stick together, you know. And now that you've taken out my rival, I'm free to rule this godforsaken planet with an iron fist. I will crush the resistance like so many insects. And <laughs> I mean, it'll be a happy time for everyone. Slumber. I should get going. Have some more tea. I'm not as tea. Everyone yet. drinks tea. Drink it. <laughs> Do you happen to know how to get to the wizard? Actually, you must go to the guides of Oz. They'll tell you. Now, can we have some girl chat? Uh, the Wicked Witch of the West is looking for you. She hates you. I didn't do anything to her. Of course you did, but she still hates you anyway. <laughs> now, my advice to you, girl to girl, ruthless domination, okay? Ruthless domination. It's wonderful. If there's anything in your path that impedes the attainment of your ultimate goals, there's just one thing to do. Annihilate it! Are you sure you're a good witch? Good, bad. It's all about packaging. I found. See? I got it. <laughs> and remember, it's not wrong to kill if it gets you what you want. And don't step on any flowers! They'll hate you too! Which one of you is a liar? He is! That's what he told the 
truth. I do. Who's the wizard? That way! Do I look good in this shirt? Yes. No. <laughs> Did he just lie? He has impossibly high standards. He has no standards whatsoever. I think she looks lovely. She's disgusting. I am vomiting inside my mouth. What? <laughs> You're hideous. She doesn't deserve she that. She totally deserved that. Okay, then you must be quick. I'm quick. Shut up. I enjoy your company. You seem like a nice person. I don't hate you at all. Are you really the guides of Oz? I am. He isn't. I think you're smart. <laughs> How am I supposed to find a lizard if there's no yellow road? Well, most of the time in life there aren't any roads. What does that mean? I don't have an itch. <laughs> you see, it's not as simple as you've been led to believe. You may find the wizard and still not know what you're looking for. I want to go home, do you? I find this very interesting. I'm not bored at all. Please shut up! Mother like you bet. Hey! <laughs> what am I supposed to do if I do find the wizard? Ask him a question. What question? That's for you to discover. I have faith that you'll find the right question. We have to be going. I'd like to stay. Follow me, Quacks. So. Okay. Just so you know, you and your little personal tragedies are of the utmost importance to everyone else. This way. You look good for the dog. <laughs> ah! 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 Did you see that? A fine dog almost killed me. I barely survived. You are the cowardly lion. How do you know my name? What have they told you about? Who told you? You've been following me, haven't you? No, I haven't. It's just I've heard of you. That's all. FBI after me? Oh my god, I'm having a panic attack. First that dog and now this. Relax, all right? Come any closer. Ah! I'm very fierce. <laughs> Just leave me alone. I don't have a wallet because I'm a lion. <laughs> Let me live. I'll tell you where I have my gold. I don't want your gold. You'll never take me alive! Shut up and listen! My name is Beth. I'm trapped here. And you're hungry. You're gonna eat me. I'm not gonna eat you! Please don't yell. I can't stand it when people yell. <laughs> I don't want to be in this movie, so I'm trying to find the wizard. But some munchkin told me that they sold the Yellow Road, so I guess there isn't going to be any singing and dancing. I get very nervous when people sing and dance. I'm sure you do. But do you happen to know how to get to the wizard? I have a feeling I'm not getting out of here until I find it. Well, without the Yellow Road, we'll have to go through that field of deadly flowers. And from there, I'll have to go through the deadly forest. And from the deadly forest, over the deadly gentle hill. We'll never make it. I'm going to stay right here. No. If you came to see the wizard, he might be able to give you some courage. You'd like that, wouldn't you? So you can kill me! I'm not trying to kill you! <laughs> That's exactly what someone's trying to kill me would say. Uh, I'm freaking out. You can't be afraid of everything. Most of the time in life, there's nothing to be scared of. What about the rest of the time? <laughs> <laughs> well, there are some times you do actually need to be afraid. Oh my god! Stop it! <laughs> you can stay here if you want. Of course, you'll be staying here all alone. All, all alone? <laughs> I'm sure it won't be a problem for you. It's not like the trees are going to come to life and eat you or anything. Wait, 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 wait. How about I go with you to see the wizard? That's what I thought. All right, follow me. Actually, wait. Don't follow me. It freaks me out. What am I supposed to do then? Walk in front of me so I know where you're going. But then I don't know where I'm going. We're even then. Just walk forward. And for God's sake, watch over those flowers. And the crows! <laughs>
<laughs> Are they gone yet? Yes! You have heroically escaped the crows! You were insane. Do you know that? That worries me that you would say that. Who's there? Ah! Hi, my name is Beth. I'm lost. That over there is the cowardly lion. We're off to see the wizard, but we're not following the elder crow because we sold the Taurus, and I'm guessing you're the scarecrow. Am I? Yes, I think you are. Really? Yes. And what is it I'm supposed to be doing? Standing in a field scaring the crows? Okay, then hey! Hey, crows! Ah! <laughs> What's wrong with him? He's just terrified of everything. Do you happen to want to visit wizards? I don't know anything, and I'm keeping it that way. You know how most people know stuff? I know nothing. <laughs> Try me. There's nothing I don't know that I don't know. Or the opposite. Sue? No idea. What color is the sky? Haven't a clue. What's your name? Couldn't know less. See? Totally and completely ignorant. Life is beautiful. <laughs> How do you figure that? You don't know anything. Which is exactly why life is so good for me. I could be having a terrible life, but I wouldn't know. If I was aware of things, I might think, why am I standing out in a field getting rained on and having birds pee on me? <laughs> Do birds pee? I don't know. <laughs> and I'm not about to find out. You see how that works? You see how happy I am? Ignorance is bliss and I am needy, but it, is the world gonna end tomorrow? Beats me. Did my parents yell at me as a child? No clue. <laughs> Will I die alone? Who cares? <laughs> you should try it. No thanks. If you don't believe in your troubles, then your troubles can't get to you. Deny, deny, deny. What are your troubles? No idea. And look at how happy I am. You can't just stay here and be stupid your entire life. Most people manage it. In fact, we stupid people remember you by quiet ways. You're lucky we don't rise up and destroy you. If only we could figure out how to organize ourselves. Well, maybe if you came to see the wizard, you could find oh, out. No, 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 no. Don't try to educate me. I'm perfectly happy the way that I am. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go out for a while and stare at his face. Let's get out of here quick. We can't just let him sit here and wall when it's ignorant. That sounds like a great idea. Oh, Scarecrow, did you hear the news? Nope. Oh, that's too bad for you. Why? You'll find out. What news? I don't want to know. <coughs> it's probably better that way. It won't hurt as much when they catch you. Someone's being caught? When who? The Board of Education. They take the student, tie them up, and inject knowledge straight into their brain. You become a genius. And the only way to avoid being educated is to appeal to the government. Just talk with them for a little while, and you will know less than when you began. We have to find the government! Where are they? I don't know. Well, I don't know either! We're all gonna die! Or be educated, whichever is worth. Follow me. Actually, wait. Don't follow me. Walk in front of me so I know where you're going. I'm not going to hurt you. I cannot take any chances. <laughs> you too, Scarecrow. Ah, turn left down. Oil. 
There should be some around here somewhere. How do you know that? She's a witch! I knew it, Brian! I'm not a witch, all right? Just look for a can of oil, please. What does it look like? What was that? You can! It's a bomb! Not a bomb! <laughs> it's not a bomb! I have no idea how much that sucked. <laughs> yeah, do you mind? Do you know the way to the Emerald City? It's that way. Which way? Oh, my arm. Dang it, and I can show you. <laughs> that way. Now, do you mind? You're not very nice. Shut up and oil me. There's not much oil in here. I don't know how much I can do. Just my luck. I am having the worst day. Ma'am, do your leg. There. Oh, wow. Now I can move half my body! That's so much better than not being able to move at all! You're awesome! Don't be a jerk about it! Hey, Furball! Help me up. Do it, or I'm gonna make a rug out of it. <laughs> Careful! I'm slipping! Oops. <laughs> moron! If anyone's the moron here, it's me! Hey. <laughs> me? Up! I say we leave him here. He already told us he's ready to go. Pick me up or I'll scream! Yeah, I don't know. You're not very pleasant. Don't leave me here. I'll sue you all. If you come with us, you need to be nicer. <laughs> okay. Okay. Sorry. Why are you so mean anyway? It's a defense mechanism. I lash out because I feel inadequate. <laughs> Why is that? Oh, I don't know. It might have something to do with the fact that I'm made out of tin. And every time I hang out in the rain, I basically go into a coma. That might have a little something to do with it. You see, I used to be a real boy. What happened? A witch cast a spell on me and took away the girl that I loved. <laughs> Shut up, brainless. Anyway, to make a long story short, I turned into this, and the whiz kid who put me together forgot to give me a coat. Banner day around here. Most of the around here do seem pretty stupid. Yeah, tell me about it. The guy who put me together, he left my heart on the table. Totally spaced it. So now I just can't feel any emotions whatsoever. You seem like you're feeling angry. It's more annoyance! <laughs> I figure the one good thing about all of this is that I no longer care about the fact that I lost my true love. In fact, I am totally cool with it. If I had a heart, if I had a heart, I suppose that it would be broken. Maybe the wizard can help you. Probably not. It can't hurt to try. It hurts a lot more to try and fail than to never try at all. But it's more interesting this way. Besides, you might have oil. I could use that.
and she said she was going the other way. Back that way. Oh, sorry for the confusion. No worries. Hey, how come you're green? <laughs> Excuse me? Have you tried like skincare or anything? It might help you. Shut up! You dare insult me? Hey! He can insult you all he wants. I don't care. Guys, guys, <laughs> they don't mean it. I have had an extremely bad day. Did you know that? <laughs> My sister just died, all right? So what? Did your sister just die? Yes. You're wicked, which is the East. We're related. Who, who? So what? Everybody's got problems. Wait, who died? I'm so confused. My sister, okay? sister is dead. A house fell on her. Right. I'm sorry. Excuse me? I'm sorry for your loss. Well, that doesn't change anything, does it? I am going to get that girl and I'm going to have my revenge. But there's nothing to be revenged upon. The girl from Kansas didn't kill your sister. She wasn't driving the house. It was just, it was just what? It was just the way things are sometimes. Sometimes terrible things happen for no reason at all. Hey, who cares about one? Dead witch! Get over it! Don't listen to him. He's just heartless. I am going to get that girl and your little dog, too! Will not bring her back to life? She's dead. Getting revenge on the little girl isn't going to help anything. What do you know about it? I know how you feel. I have a sis... I had a sister, too. What? <laughs> what should I do then? You could come with us. We're going to see the wizard. Maybe he can help. The wizard? Apparently he's wonderful. Maybe we can talk with him. Maybe he could use his magic. All my friends here need his help too. I mean, look at these guys. They're totally incapable of functioning in society. It's true. What are we talking about? Come with us. Well, I could use somebody halfway normal. Okay, let's go see the wizard. Anybody want to ride on my group? Brain. No, I could not. But I am perfectly content 
innocent in my ignorance? The Tin Man use a heart. I don't really care, to be honest with you. Uh, very well. Hoi! Lion, come forward. No. Come forward or I'll hit you. You already have courage. Do not. Do too, too. It took great courage to accompany Beth to meet me here today. Therefore, I am conferring upon you this badge of courage <laughs> to prove that you are the mightiest of all the lions. I am the king of the jungle! Roar! Now then, Scarecrow, come here. I'm enrolling you in online classes at the University of Phoenix. <laughs> no way! Way? The University of Phoenix will not educate you. <laughs> However, it will provide you with a diploma. <laughs> that way, you can earn more money without having to go through the trouble of actually learning anything. Where was I? <laughs> and finally, Tin Man, come forward. You showed great heart by not using your fast robotic strength to crush us all. I have vast robotic strength? No way. No way? That took heart. So, I'm giving you this heart sticker to put on your chest to prove, to prove to you that with great power. Cool. Uh, what about the witch? The witch! Hey! You do not belong here! The witch just wants a little sister back. So? So, if this is really the movie, then things have a way of working themselves out. So, maybe if Cop, we Please! Why would I want that witch back alive? She wasn't a witch. Uh... Well, sometimes she wasn't the most pleasant. So, most of the time she was pretty nice. My point is, is that maybe bad things don't have to happen to people. I mean, she wasn't doing anything wrong. She was just standing there when it happened. I don't deserve to just die like that. It's not fair. And how do you know all this? I was in the house when it happened. What do you mean you were in the house? I was in the house, okay? But it wasn't my fault. You were driving? Well, it was you were driving the car? Yes! I was driving the car! But it wasn't my fault! I was looking at the road. I had my eyes on the road. But it was raining really hard. I could barely see anything. We were coming back from a concert, and everyone was driving really fast. And then this truck went past me. One of those big sunny trucks, and it kicked up all this water on my windshield. And the next thing I knew, the whole car started spinning, and I heard this huge thump. And then everything was really slow, and I remember seeing us turn around the lane. And then there was another car, and it felt like bumper cars all of a sudden. And then my sister shouted something, but I can't remember what it was. And then we were in the ditch. I tried everything I could. I did. I was screaming, but everything was so quiet, and I remember thinking that I was bleeding, and then I blacked out. They told me later. So, I want... What I want from all of this is... I just want to go home. I want you to send me back home with my sister still there. I want you to send me before this. She didn't get a chance to grow up, you know? Why even get a life if it's just going to end early? So, can you please just do that? Beth, I'm afraid I'm just not enough of a wizard for that. Then what's the point of all of this? What am I supposed to do now? I suppose you have a choice. You can continue to forever fill your body with anger, fear, ignorance, and guilt. Or you can go on and live your life the way that your sister would have wanted you to by taking one step forward every day. I just want to go home. And what will you do there? Go on, I guess. Jill? Now then, all you have to do is... Click my heels, right? And when you do that, Beth, I want you to remember not what happened at the end, but what happens along the way 
because that is what you take with you, you know? That's how your sister lives now. She goes on through you, wherever you may go in this life. Thank you. Oh, and as for you, witch, I'd get inside if I were you. Why is that? It's about to rain. Wait, here. No melting today. Thanks. There is no place like home. There is no place like home.